What's up guys and welcome to my uh, test of the Huawei Mate 20 Pro's video bokeh mode or blur effect video as they like to call it. Um, this feature we normally see on most sort of high-end smartphones these days uh, but only in photograph form not so much in video. Um, it's the first time I've ever tried anything like this out. So uh, let me know how it's going. What's the edge detection like? How is the blur on it? Is it is it too much? Just or is it just right? One thing I will say about it, you can only film in 1080p at 30 frames per second maximum on it. Um, what I will do now, I'll cut to another uh, video showing anyone who wants to use this feature, how you do enable it. And uh, so you can maybe try it for yourselves. Right, so anyone who wants to enable um, background blur mode on the Mate 20 Pro, Simply go to the camera, select video, then press on this little icon just there, a little wand or something, I think. And there you have your different effects. AI color mode, which I've chosen uh, to test out before. And there's the background blur and simply select it and record away. So one issue I've noticed, if you have uh, been recording in one of these modes on here, it will not automatically revert back to anything higher than 1080p 30 frames per second. So if you've previously had it on 4K, it will not go back to that once you've turned off any of the AI sort of features. You have to go back to the settings menu, then select the resolution, and then up it to whatever it was beforehand. As you can see, that's at 4K at the moment. If I go into the video effects, and then select, say, AI color, go back to the resolution settings. It's now put it at 1080, 30 frames per second and you cannot select anything higher than that. We go back, turn off the AI mode. And then if you go back to the resolution settings, you can then select 4K again, or higher than 1080p30. So just something to bear in mind that if you try this out, don't think it's automatically going to go back to the resolution you may have had it set on beforehand. Because I've I've made that mistake when I had the AI colour on. Uh, and I was trying to do some video tests and that sort of screwed it all up for me. And I had to redo them again. So, just sort of bear in mind. Anyway, thanks for uh, watching this video. And if you liked it, please uh, like and subscribe. Cheers.